In this video, we are going to discuss a previous gate problem related to lead compensator. We can observe the problem here. The pole zero configuration of a phase lead compensator is. So, here we need to find out what is the pole zero configuration or pole zero plot of a phase lead compensator. So, we already analyzed both phase, uh, lead compensator and lag compensator. So, here in that you know the transfer functions. So, here the transfer function, the general transfer function of a lead compensator is equal into S plus 1 by Z divided by S plus 1 by alpha Z. So, this is your general transfer function of a lead compensator where alpha is greater than 1. Alpha is not greater than 1, alpha is less than 1. So, in case of lag compensator, so you will get beta Z and that beta is greater than 1. So, now here if you consider poles and zeros, where you will get zeros, here you will get zeros and here 1 0 will be there. So, that 0 value is equivalent to minus 1 by z. If you are having confusion about this z, you can replace z by 1 by t. You can consider t also, t or any value. So, 1 by t is plus 1 by alpha t. Like that also you can consider. So, here s is equivalent to minus 1 by z is one value and this is 0 because this is in numerator. So, this is equivalent to 0. And coming to pole, so where you will get pole S is equal to minus alpha Z, you will get 1 on the pole. So, these two are indicated on a S plane. This is S plane, so with J omega and sigma. And here 1 by Z, if I considered here, definitely 1 by alpha Z can be considered here. So, this is 1 by alpha Z. And this is equal to 1 by z. Why? Because why I am considering like this? So, if alpha is less than 1, alpha is less than 1 means it may be 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3 like that. So, then here for example, I am having alpha is equal to 0 0.1. Then this is equal to 1 by 10. So, that means so, 10 by z, I will get minus 10 by z here and 1 by z here. So, how we can take, we will take like this only, right. So, that is why I am considering like this. This is pole, not 0, uh, this is 0, not pole. So, this minus 1 by z is 0 and this one is pole. Where I need to locate this pole? So, right to this 0 or left to this 0 means, so we need to represent left to this 0. The reason is this, you just substitute alpha is equal to less than 1 value, point 0.1 is less than 1 only. If I substituted alpha is equal to point 0.1, then that is equal to 1 by 10. If I substituted in this minus 10 by z, minus 10 by z will be left to 1 by z. So, that is why I am representing my pole left to this 0. So, the pole 0 flat of lead compensator you need to get like this. So, which one? is matching means so b option is the right option for this problem if you see here for right side of zero you are having pole for this there are two poles and one zero but we are having only one pole and one zero if you consider here this zero crossed this j omega axis so whenever you are using compensator means the system is stable the system need to be stable. So, here I am having sometimes they will give like this. They will move some poles to this side. So, then we will get problem. So, like this way we need to filter the options and this is right option for your problem. And here why I can't take this value means you can see you can get doubt also. Why I can't take this? This is also pole is left to this 0. Yes, pole is left to 0, but pole itself indicating minus value. So, I can't take my pole here. So, that should be in this plane. That means that should be in negative real axis. So, like this way we need to solve problems related to 
पोल जीरो प्लाट ऑफ लीड कंपेंसेटर